Now we turn our attention to podcaster Joe Rogan vowing to balance things out after music legends Neil Young and Joni Mitchell pull their catalogs from Spotify in protest of his show. So Rogan is accused of spreading false information about the coronavirus. And Spotify has updated their content guidelines, but all of Rogan's episodes are still available for streaming. I'm not trying to promote misinformation. I'm not trying to be controversial. Joe Rogan speaks I'm, I'm out after episodes of his podcast spark public outrage for spreading false information about the coronavirus. In April 2021, Rogan told his listeners he didn't think young people should get vaccinated. People say, do you think it's safe to get vaccinated? I've said, yeah, I think for the most part, it's safe to get vaccinated. I do. I do. But if you're like 21 years old and you say to me, should I get vaccinated? I, I go, no. Rogan hosts Spotify's number one podcast, which boasts 11 million listeners. Plan the streaming stages. giant acquired the show in 2020 for a reported stupid? $100 million. In December, 260 doctors and healthcare professionals signed this open letter, calling out Rogan and Spotify for the baseless conspiracy theories his guest, Dr. Robert Malone, promoted. Last week, musician Neil Young demanded his music be removed from the platform, telling Spotify, quote, they can have Rogan or Young, not both. Folk singer Joni Mitchell followed suit along with guitarist Nils Lofgren from Bruce Springsteen's E Street Band. After Young pulled his catalog, Spotify lost more than $2 billion in market value. Spotify has since announced that a content advisory will be added to any podcast episode that discusses COVID-19. They confirmed they have policies in place to remove false information about the virus. Do I get things wrong? Absolutely, I get things wrong, but I try to correct them. Whenever I get something wrong, I try to correct it. Rogan is now promising to balance more controversial viewpoints with other people's perspectives on his show. Of course, we'll continue to bring you the very latest on this story as it develops.